Hey there everyone, welcome back. Um, thanks for coming back to my channel. Uh, today I have a review for you of Homeworks by Harry Slotkin, Clementine Blossom. The coloring on this screen does not do this candle kind of justice, but let's take it all around here. Look at that, we have a grove of clementines and oranges. It is amazing. Now the candle that this comes with, comes with Cit uh, gar citrus Garden Mint. So these are the two candles that come together. So they're both citrusy candles. Uh, this has to be my favorite duo of the spring. I reviewed this one already. I, I encourage you to check it out. Um, I just ordered another set tonight of this duo because, as you all know, or maybe you don't know, May 15th is the shipping deadline for uh, Homeworks by Harry Slotkin because his candles, uh, his wax formula can't handle the heat. So over the summer, they won't ship because you have the chance of melting uh, the candles, um, you know, the candles melting in the heat on the on the trucks there. And you open it, you don't get a good experience. So that's, you know, Harry's about having a good experience. So this candle, oh man, in a nutshell, have you ever been on Soarin' in Disney World or Disneyland? Well, the old Soarin', I haven't been on the new Soarin', where Soarin' around... Soaring around the country, soaring around the world, I think it is. But the original Soaring had you flying through. And if you haven't been on this ride, it's awesome. It's you have a huge screen in front of you, huge screen, and you have multiple rows. And it's like you're in a, uh, uh, it's not a kite, but what, what do they call them? Wind sail? Hang gliders. It's like you're in a hang glider. You, you you're sitting up and you go up in the air, big screen, and then your seat actually moves, but you're not actually moving per se. It's the way the film is. And they have you flying literally through a, a Florida orange grove. And that is exactly... And, and they have smell. So as you're flying through like the pine forest, you, you smell the pines. And as you're flying through this orange grove, they project the, the smell of this orange grove to you. And that is exactly the way that this candle smells. It's a very sweet, fresh... Um, orange it's like you are in an orange grove like it's like a fresh picked orange um it is amazing um like i said this to me is probably the best duo for me um that harry released uh this spring you know a couple of the florals i have i have the summer zinnias i have the pink geranium um that's another fabulous fabulous duo um, i have the ice cream candles they're fabulous um but to me there's just something about this set that uh, I love a good lemon scent. I, I just love good citrus scents. And I know a lot of people said this is this is just a dupe of, you know, uh, lemon mint leaf lemon mint leaf from uh, from Bath and Body Works. I don't think it is. This scent I said in my review it reminds me of my grandmother's iced tea when she would make the fresh squeezed lemon, put the lemon the lemon in the iced tea. Um, so that's partially why I ordered another set because it does have that awesome uh, sentimental value to it. Uh, a lot of Harry's old scents from uh, his Slatkin and, and Co days from Bath and Body Works. Um, I have a bunch of those scents and a lot of those scents I don't I don't burn anymore. I just smell them in the jar um, because uh, some very important life events happened uh, that I associate with those candles at the time. So um, I just have those. I, I kept them. So. Uh, life is about scent. Scent brings back memories, uh, good or bad. Uh, scent just evokes that uh, emotion in you. So, uh, thankfully, all of Harry's scents bring back good emotions. So, um, anyhow, back to review of Clementine Blossom. These were 18 ounce candles, three wicks. Um, I did not uh, take care of trimming the wick, not trimming the wick, but pulling the mushroom tops off there. But as you can see, really no issue with the burn. Um, I'm getting some smuts on the side of the jar, but nothing compared to any other candle, um, like Bath and Body Works, which are just nasty burning lately. And uh, I think uh, most candle reviewers are kind of shying away from them because they have not been putting out good products lately. So, um, 18 ounce candles, 30 to 55 hour burn time on them, exclusive to QVC. Uh, you have a couple weeks to get them before the May 15th uh, shipping deadline. Harry's coming back on QVC May 1st and May 2nd. Not sure what he's going to be talking about, but I assume it's going to be a push to um, get the candles, uh, you know, let you know to order the candles now because 
May 15th comes, no candle products until September 15th. So we have here Clementine Blossom. We have Clementine Flower, Fresh Bergamot, Neroli, and Tangerine. So this is citrus all the way through, basically, with the bergamot in there. Now, the uh, the the Neroli, right, that's like that's an oil uh, coming from the orange flower and everything. That can taste, that cannot taste, but that can smell um, a little metallic-y. And you don't get that at all on this. Like I said, this is literally a fresh orange grove. Take that fresh, super sweet. Um, my wife's aunt lives in California, and in uh, her development, they have uh, orange trees, grapefruit trees, lemon trees, and they have this one um, plant. It's it's a fruit producing, citrus producing plant called Tangelos, and they're. Not quite like navel oranges or not clementines, but they're super sweet citrus orangey things. And we, when we go out there, we take the little picker thing, we pull them off, and then we take them back to the kitchen, and we'll you know take this, uh, cut them in half, and then we'll squeeze them for juice. That's what this reminds me of. Also, so if you are in the California region or have ever had Tangelos uh, and Tangelo fresh squeezed juice, that's what this candle smells like. Basically, fresh orange. Once again, the orange all coming through there, the, the orange grove. Um, it's just a fresh squeezed, really orange. It's not sharp. There's no tartness. There's no acidity to this. Um, it's a very sweet orange. And I know when Harry did his presentation on this a few weeks back, um, he said it's basically like when you take the orange and you let it sit there and you let it get over ripen and then you squeeze it, that's what it is. So you get the super, super sweetness without the acidity. Uh, it's not like an orange juice, don't get me wrong, it's not an orange juice, but that Tangelo juice, if you have access to Tangelos and you cut them and eat them and you drink it, that's what this smells like. So, once again, Clementine Blossom is awesome. Love it, love it, love it. Um, this, this whole duo to me, if I had to rate the duos that I have, this would be number one, number one duo there. So, uh, they retail for about $39.90. For the pair, 550 shipping, about $45 out the door at $47 with tax. Um, certain ones are on sale right now. His tropical ones are on sale. So, um, once again, put them on your calendars from May 1st to May 2nd on QVC. Uh, give me some comments. Give me some likes. Uh, thumbs up there. Below, I have my Instagram and Twitter. Please subscribe. I'm always posting some new, new things, breaking news. Um, for uh, a lot of the candle guys out there. So, all right. Thanks for uh, thanks for watching and. Um, Christmas in July is coming up. Harry has some new stuff coming out Christmas in July. Um, look for that schedule on QVC. Also, I do have his gingerbread figural from last year, his ceramic figural. It's like this big, nine inches. Um, I didn't get it in time to review for Christmas. I just got it the other day. So what I'm going to do with that is I'm going to be posting a review sometime in the beginning to early July, certainly before, uh, his Christmas in July special. In case he comes out with a new gingerbread house this year, which is highly likely, um, I can't confirm that, but I would imagine he would since he did back in the Slotkin and Co. days. So every year was a different gingerbread house. Uh, so what I want to show you is the detail um, and how I'm not going to necessarily review the product because you can't buy it anymore, but I just want to kind of show you the detail of it. So um, if and when he does announce a new figure roll like this, you're have in your head, okay, this is a really good quality product, comes with a candle, um, and for this price, you know, break it down, it looks good. So uh, that's kind of my intention for that, just to kind of inform you on it, because if I, I know if I had seen this last year, I would have bought it. If I had seen a review of it ahead of time, I would have bought it. I hemmed and hauled on it, but I'm glad I got it for a decent price. So um, I thank you for watching. I appreciate all the support, everybody. Uh, it means a lot to me. So I know it's running long, but thank you for watching. Um, and I will uh, be back with maybe one more homeworks review before the shipping deadline. I have some resinias burned. I have to review it. I don't have to review it, but I want to review it. Um, I don't know if I'm going to get to burn pink geranium. Um, I did burn fresh the fresh strawberries. Ah, oh, that's too another one I can do. So um, we'll see. But thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one. Talk to you later.